All right, I'm going to show you another example of how the English Standard Version updates the terrible archaic language of the King James Bible. It's just so hard to understand. Let's let's look at this. Matthew chapter 23, verse 10. Neither be ye called masters, for one is your master, even Christ. Uh, yeah, you really shouldn't be calling people master. Right? That's kind of a bond servant to the master kind of a thing. I uh, you know, the Lord's saying here, don't be called, you know, neither be ye called masters, for one is your master, even Christ. So let's see, I mean, this is, I, I know it's, you're probably just scratching your head and, and get, probably getting a migraine headache thinking, what does this verse mean? It's just so archaic. What is a master? I don't even know. Let's see how the ESV uh, <clears throat> updates this particularly hard verse to understand. Neither be called instructors, for one, for you have one instructor, the Christ. The Christ. I find that interesting, too, there. The Christ. Not Christ, but, the, you know, the Christ. Hmm. But instructor. You can't be called instructor. That's kind of weird, you know. Uh, why change master to instructor? Really weird.